Hello everybody and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more uh, Persona 3 Reload and uh, here we are on 425. Looks like I've got a message from Mitsuru. I'll be in the command room today. If you want to go to Tartarus, come and let me know. I'll be able to join you as well. Okay, interesting. Let's talk to everybody and then decide what we're going to do tonight. They say it's, uh, they say it'll still be some time before my injuries fully heal. Uh, well, I hope I can get back to fighting sooner rather than later. Guess we'll see. Honestly, he's like one of the best characters in this game. If he's set up the same way, like, he is very good. Um... Kirijo Senpai should be in the command room. She said she was going to do some training. Oh, but she also said we can still go to Tartarus tonight if you want to. By the way... Did you hear? The used bookstore at the Iwatodai strip mall just reopened. Usually you can find the rarest or rare manga buried somewhere at those kind of shops. Ah, maybe I should go check it out. I'm actually pretty good at digging up treasure. Jeez. Uh, go for it, but try not to clown around there too much, alright? Yeah, the old couple deserve better than that. <laughs> we're gonna buy a mad bowl, because I'm pretty sure that's one of the ones that we're gonna need later. Honestly, I should buy several, because having SP items is useful. Hmm? Is something the matter? Just wanted to chat. Hmm. Detection ability is crucial for exploring Tartarus efficiently. I've been training my own such abilities, but it will take more work still before I am fully competent. It's a bank of consoles. I don't know how to use it. It seems very advanced. Look at that. I was just thinking to myself, I wonder if these things are here. And they are. <laughs> so it looks like we need to do a full sweep of the dorm to make sure that there aren't any more of those that we're missing. Do we think there's one in my room? No, we got the one on our bed, so I doubt they'd put another one, right? Floors explored up to 19, and we only made it to what 11? Oh, yeah, we, we gotta we got more climb to do, that's for sure. Um, maybe we should try Wild Duck Burger. Maybe before I decide on that, we should check the arcade and see if um. See if we would prefer to do that since it's more points. So my guess is that most things give what? A... Hmm. You're the answer, academics. Okay. And it's Saturday. Um, we never did check this. God, I love this song. It's so good. Of course, and then I stop it. Alright, sale dates. Inventory goes on sale on Monday at Tatsumi East Police Station and on Saturday at the Pharmacy. Remember to take advantage of these discounts. I forgot about the, uh, Police Station one on Mondays. There's a sale today. Buy whatever you need. I'm gonna Which buy ones? one of these cat foods. That's all you want? Thanks for coming. Don't know when we'll need that, but I'm pretty sure we'll need it eventually.
You made up your mind? You sure? Hey! You got everything you need? Buy two medicines. Come again, yeah? Now, since tomorrow is Monday, I'm gonna check something. I don't think this is gonna be the case. But... I want to see if, um... You can sell things for more. Oh yeah, I forgot we can sell all this stuff. So valuables are just things that we can sell for just straight money. I forgot about that. Wanna sell in bulk? Damn, okay, we just practically doubled our money. Sure, it's a deal. Okay, that's good. Alright, each of these are 750. My guess is that tomorrow they will still be 750. I doubt you get more money on a sell date. Hmm? But it's the type of thing that we should check. Mystery burger. It'll cost us a thousand. Unknown ingredients and it raises courage. I decided to try the new burger. Along with some soggy duck fries, I devoured the mysterious burger. That's gross. Soggy fries are the worst. I can't stand soft fries. I always I need I need that outside crisp, you know? Was that two points? Okay, good to know. Good to know. I've got a text message. Receiving invites on days off. Some of your social links might invite you to hang out on days when you don't have school. Spending time with friends will give you a chance to build your relationships. Saying yes to an invitation will automatically fill your schedule for that afternoon, and your free time will be dedicated to that hangout. Honestly, these are so rarely useful that I almost wish that they just allowed you to do these events without spending time. Because, like, there are very few instances in, the, in these games, ever, that this is the optimal choice. <laughs> Which kind of sucks, because you, you just end up missing out on events that you want to see. Um, but, you know, that, that's been an issue in every single Persona game. If someone sends you an invite message, you don't need to respond immediately. However, the Hangout will no longer be available if you don't respond the day you receive the invitation. I do like that as a change. So we don't have to answer it right now. We can look around, decide if there's something better for us to do, and then go and hang out with him if we want. There's no school today. Okay. So let's see. Movie theater, Wakatsu Kitchen, gave money as an offering, spent time with the old couple. Oh yeah, okay, we can, we can do that. Spent time with Tamachika. Studying at your desk takes time, but academics will increase. On days when you don't have school, you may choose to take advantage of your afternoon by studying. Dude is wearing loafers. Yes? What is it? Generally speaking, you may do whatever you like on your days off. You can stay in and study or go out and enjoy yourself. It's up to you. What do you do on days off? I suppose. More often than not, I'll be in the dorm. I tend to feel more at ease keeping to my books rather than gallivanting outdoors. Gallivanting, okay. <laughs> All right, girl. Hmm? She she isn't the type to gallivant. What's up? Are you going out? What about you? I think. No, I'm being well behaved today. I can't do much with my injury, but I don't have anything in particular to take care of anyway. As soon as we leave, these two are going to start making out. Let's see if it's the case. You can go back in. All right. It used to be the case that after you left, 
on a day like a Sunday, if you returned it would automatically go to nighttime. And I never understood why that was the case. It was totally unnecessary. Okay. Hey, it's Junpei. Yo! Hey, what's up? Just wandering around. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, he just got into this town, so wandering around is good. You'll get to know the place better. All right, we're going to hang out with the old couple. So to the bookstore we go. We have a Moakane, who is of the hero uh, arcana. your name again? It's Analog Vernacular. Oh, no need to tell me. I was just joking. I'm not that senile. My wife and I were just talking about you. Tell me, do you like this kind of treat? Someone gave it to me, but I have more than enough. Go ahead and take it. Well, thank you. I'm not going to say no. Ah, oh, don't worry about it. You don't have to thank me for something. Look at all those affinity points. You're so polite, I say. You're like his complete opposite. Uh, would you like another to give to a friend? We have so many. My wife and I would take forever to finish them all. Honestly, I'd like that. That's very kind of you. Right then. Here you go. Uh, 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 for real this time. Uh, wh what was your name again? Oh, this poor old man. Goodness, dear. It's him. Remember? My apologies. He's been terribly forgetful lately. Here you are. Melon bread. Got two of them. Say, uh, uh, where did that boy run off to, dear? He should be here helping customers. Sorry about that. No need to apologize. I'm sure you could use another youngster like yourself around, instead of talking to an old man like me. I'm sure our son will be back soon enough. Right, dear? Oh, my dear, he's... He's what? Oh, that's right. Our son has already passed away. No. Oh. I'm sorry, young man. I apologize on behalf of my son for not being here to greet you. The elderly couple opened up about their painful past. I feel like we're growing closer. Rank 2 in Hierophant. Hey now, the two of you look like you just seen a ghost. It's dark outside. We don't need it to be dark in here, too. Come visit us again, will you? We'll be waiting. Must be protected at all costs. I parted with the elderly couple and went back to the dorm. They're too precious. Let me tell you something. Uh, in both boxing and actual combat, speed is key. Whether you're landing an attack or evading one, you won't succeed if you can't move quickly. I can do this. I can do this. Hmm? There we go. We made it. Huh? Is something the matter? Just wanted to chat. A piece of advice for fighting in Tartarus. To get the upper hand in combat, I suggest attacking shadows from their blind spot. You will have the advantage if you can launch a preemptive strike without being noticed. Try to utilize this technique often. By the way... Hey, Vernat-kun, have you picked up any supplies like medicine and stuff? You probably know this, but I'll tell you just in case, shops aren't open during the dark hour. So you should get whatever you might need before the dark hour. We don't want someone to get injured in Tartarus and not be able to do anything about it, you know? By the way... Well, apparently my persona is supposed to be real strong against fire. Call the fire department because I'm burning with passion, baby. 
Anyway, you can leave the strong enemies to me. I can take the heat. He does hit really hard. Okay. Let's go to the police station first. So they were 750. You made it. What do you got? Yep, still 750. Sure enough. All right. I'm sure. I'll take that. What'll it be? I got some stuff you might find useful. So feel free to browse. That what you want? Great. It's all yours. Take as long as you need. Okay, so that one gives magic plus one. I'm going to do that, that one for her. Want? All right, then. All done here? Come back soon. Okay, so we can raise a Persona Strength, Agility, or Magic. Don't want to do any of that. Um, let's see. It's not Monday yet, so we can't work at Chagall. crowded right now at Hagakure. So interesting. So since that one's going to be full sometimes, you got to really check on it, huh? I'm guessing that it gives decent points for whatever it gives. So maybe next time we find that one, we'll try it just to see what happens. Is this place always going to be too busy too? Too crowded right now. Okay. Okay, what did other people do? What is Wakatsu Kitchen? This one is the Hagakure. Is this Wakatsu? Oh, this one gives us academics. Honestly, yeah, let's let's do that too. Eat at Wakatsu. Prodigy Platter. A meal rich in omega-3s to stimulate the brain raises academics. I might want to be more focused, but like... I don't know, I'm gonna spread out some of these things and then we'll, we'll, we'll fill it out. We'll fill it out. Figure out if we need to uh, rush down any of our uh, specific, uh, uh, what am I trying to say? Stats. <laughs> Social stats, there we go. A regular customer is ordering the seafood full course. Seems like a special offer for regulars on Monday, Thursdays, Friday, and Sunday nights. Oh, interesting. Maybe if my charm was at least confident, I'd be... I'd be a memorable enough customer to be able to order it. Huh. Would that be on top of the Prodigy Platter? Maybe it's something in the ingredients, but I feel a little smarter. Okay, two points there. And that one wasn't too expensive either. I can hear people talking. Good morning. Ugh, I always feel super sleepy waking up on Mondays. And there's another special morning assembly today. Didn't we just have one last week? By the way. Remember how courageous Senpai gave that great speech last week? Apparently that got the principal really fired up and now he wants to make a follow-up speech. Excuse me? Seriously? The heck? Why do we have to suffer just because he wants to stroke his ego? First bell is rung. We'll now begin this morning's assembly. First, our principal has some words he'd like to share with you. Please give him a warm welcome. Oh my gosh, this part's so good. Thank you. What's the deal with the assembly? You think it's about the recent incidents? It's me. He shouldn't even know about the shadows or anything. I just hope this doesn't take too long. He's not exactly known for his brevity. No, he is not. <clears throat> to 
Today, I'd like to tell you about my, um, vision for this school year. As you are aware, strange incidents have been reported on the news lately. It is my firm belief that none of you are involved. However, the uncertainties of high school life are many, and overcoming this will require constant effort. You must dig down deep inside, but don't worry so much that you lose touch with reality. Uh -huh. As they say, everything in moderation. <laughs> this is the key to reaping all the rewards that school has to offer. The principal continues with his speech. Wait a minute, doesn't this remind you of Kirijo Senpai's speech? It does, but it's like about 30 times worse. <laughs> it's really bad plagiarism. Yeah, you're right. I guess he doesn't want to be outdone by a teenager. <laughs> Can't really blame him, but still. Honestly, you n nobody can live up to the standard of Mitsuru Kirijo. Like, y you just can't. So why even try, old man? So funny. Hey, girl. Do you have a minute? I'm sorry, but I'll need some of your time after school. I have a special request for you. A special request? I apologize if I'm being abrupt, but I couldn't think of a better person to ask. I'll tell you more about it after school. Until then. Let's begin. Miss Miyahara. All right, let's review quadratic functions. You all remember those, don't you? Sometimes the graph will be a parabola or something, sometimes a hyperbola. Well, they're certainly beautiful curves, but they can't measure up to parabolic and hyperbolic spirals. These are algebraic spirals. Look, aren't they magnificent? So, after that. Now then, let's see if you can answer this from a mathematical point of view, Iori-kun. Which of the following is not an algebraic spiral? Wait, what? Uh, hold up, how the heck am I supposed to know something like that? Analog, do you know which one's not an algebra- uh, <laughs> Sorry. Analog, do you know which one's not an algebraic- alge ugh, Algebraic spiral or whatever? Um... I'm thinking it's either C or D, but I don't know for sure. Oh, we do have access to network now. Okay, here- I'm, Whenever we have access to network for these questions, I'm going to make a guess before checking the network. But we are going to use the network to help us find the correct answer. I'm going to guess D. I think there's a strong chance it might be C as well. Although maybe B is too uniform. Okay, I guess it's A. <laughs> so, <laughs> so in other words, I couldn't have been more wrong. I was like, it's D or maybe C, but maybe B. And then it turns out to be A. Wow, now I'm feeling real dumb. Okay. Guess it's A. A beauty, isn't it? Correct. Well done. This is a logarithmic spiral. When the golden ratio is the growth factor, it's called a golden spiral. Just as the name implies, you can graph an algebraic spiral using an algebraic equation. B is the Archime Ar Archimede Archimedean spiral, C is a parabolic spiral, and D is a lit litus. I'm butchering this. All of which are algebraic spirals. However, A, the logarithmic spiral, is not considered an algebraic sp spiral. Sure. It is a common spiral found in nature, such as on nautilus shells and sunflower seeds. No matter how far you scale in or out, the shape remains roughly the same. This is called self-similarity. The way it spirals kind of reminds me of Tartarus. Thanks, man. What? Just me? Uh, anyways, thanks for your help, dude. Vernacun gave him the answer just now. He must be really smart. I can hear my classmates whispering, and my charm goes up. I've become slightly more popular. Sorry to keep you waiting. To make a long story short, I'd like you to join student council. That sounds like a lot of work, Mitsuru. We meet regularly, but I don't expect you to participate every time. Just come to the student council room when you can. Why me? Because of your ability to lead. 
Being president is very time-consuming. I'd like to have an ally to support me in the event of an emergency. An ally meaning someone who understands my situation. You know what it means to be a leader, so I'm asking you. Honestly, coming from her, that means a lot. Like, that makes me feel good inside. <laughs> All right, I'll do it. I will do it. Excellent. I knew I could count on you. And I've already filed and approved your student council membership on your behalf. <laughs> but you'll have to go to the faculty office on your own to sign everything. Okay. Seems like in order to join the student council, I have to go find Miss Toriyumi. I need to tell her that I'm going to join student council. I'm sorry for making arrangements without your permission, but I hope you understand the position I'm in. Once you're ready, come to the student council room. I'll be waiting for you there. I mean, she could probably ask me to punch a baby and I, like, probably wouldn't do it, but I'd consider it, you know? I'd at least consider it. Mitsuru has left the classroom. It seems I can join the student council if I submit some paperwork at the faculty office. I should head to the faculty office when I have some free time. Oh, oh Vernet-kun. I heard you joined the track team. They said you showed a lot of promise. I'm on the archery team. Okay, we must not have, um... Okay, we've gone through those dialogues, but that may have been the time that I reloaded, or did the rewind. Okay, student council room. I'm pretty sure that I can't actually go in there right now until we go and talk to Miss Toriyumi. It's the faculty office. It looks like I can't get in through the door on this side. Oh, what can I do for you? Um, it's about student council. Yes, yes. Kirijo-san filled me in. All we need is your signature, so read through this and sign here. All right, looks good. You can leave the rest to me. Good luck in student council. You now have access to the student council room. Okay. I don't think there's anything else we need to do today, right? Student council room. I got permission to join the student council. Maybe I should introduce myself. Let's just see what other people did. Most likely, yeah, most people are going to do what we're going to do. All right, everyone. This is who I've been talking to you about. He'll be joining us in student council starting today. Ah, so he's the one. I'm Hidetoshi Odegir. I supervise the disciplinary committee. I'm Chihiro Fushimi, the treasurer. I'm a first year, and, um, I'm still learning the ropes, so please be patient with me. Well, I'll do my best. I would certainly hope so. You must be quite talented to be handpicked by the president herself. I look forward to working with you. I think I made a good impression on Odagiri. I joined the student council and got to know the members. I hope I get along with everyone here. Card number four. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast established a new bond. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the Emperor Arcana. Okay, this is the student council, the Emperor, um, and this is mostly based around Odagiri when it comes down to it, but uh, what this card is, is it, su it is suggestive of stability and security in life. You are on top of things and everything is under your control. It is your hard work, discipline, and self-control that have brought you this far. It means that you are in charge of your life, now setting up your own rules and boundaries. 
And as I'm going through these, like those are kind of like the overarching meanings of the cards, but there are also positive and negative attributes associated to each card as well. Um, I'm not talking about them now, but we will talk about them as we complete some of these. So just keep that in mind. There are positives and negatives to each late. of these. Introductions will be enough for today. What we want from you is to assist us as necessary. From now on, you have my permission to enter the student council room whenever you wish. Your time is your own after school, but try to remember the student council every now and then. We meet on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, but we don't meet on days before tests. Thanks for coming today. Okay, all checks out. I parted ways with the student council members and went back to the dorm. Welcome back. What's up, dude? All oh, right, I heard you might be joining the student council. Karito senpai you sure you want to let a slacker like this guy join? I'm not forcing him, but if you're concerned about his work ethic, would you rather join yourself? Oh, <sighs> um, I'll pass. Thanks for the offer. <laughs> hmm, student council, huh? Well, as exciting as that sounds, I think I'll pass. That reminds me. So, I heard Mitsuru ask you to join the student council. Sorry if it feels like you're being forced to, but I'm sure she could really use your help. Anyway, it's ultimately up to you, so give us some thought. Hmm? Is something the matter? Just wanted to chat. <sighs> As president of the student council, I'm really quite busy. In fact, it's quite rare that I have any time to rest. Greatly appreciate. I won't require your help con constantly, but stop by the student council room when you have time. I'll look forward to your contributions. I don't think I really have time for student council. I'm busy enough with archery, studying, and fighting shadows. It's already kind of a lot. And I mean, Kurijo Senpai is just... Uh, actually, it's, it's nothing. N never mind. She's just what? She's just... She's, she's just what? Yukari. Let's see what's on TV. In today's exchange rate, the shifting economy has strengthened the dollar against the yen. The current exchange rate is 1 USD to 115 yen. The change marks the yen's 1.4% weakening from yesterday. Okay, we could work at Chagall tonight. I know I don't necessarily need to save because we have the rewind, but I'm doing it anyway. Um, okay. So, Hagakure Rama. Okay, so that one helps with charm. I might undo this, but... I just have noticed that a lot of people are going to Hagakure Ramen a lot, so I'm like, maybe I should too, but I don't know. I ordered Shoyu Ramen with pork. Thanks to the collagen in the food, I feel like the texture of my skin has improved. Okay, you get two points for that. And honestly, it's not that expensive, so I wonder if that's why it's, um, you know, one that a lot of people have been doing. I think I do want to... Man, I wish they would just let me go to the menu. Skip it all, skip it all, skip it all, come on. Okay, so back to evening. Yeah, may as well just go to that one, huh? So yeah, we can get two different points. So it's it's whether or not we want to get two points in one thing or whether we want to spread them out, right? Um, but the other nice thing about Chagall is that we can also make a tiny bit of money as well. Isn't it like 2,000 or 2,500 yen or something each time? Which, you know, like... Well, let's actually check because I don't remember how much you actually earn. We're going to work part-time. 
I should have checked the arcade, but that's okay. I sweated it out while working part-time as a waiter. I was given a cup of the cafe signature pheromone coffee during my break. I found an infamous bug and got rid of it before customers noticed. <laughs> infamous, huh? Here's your paycheck for today. Try to use it wisely. Shit, how much was it? <laughs> it went way too fast. <laughs> After dealing with difficult customers, I feel like my charm and courage have increased. It's getting late. I should head back to the dorm. Good morning. Have you gotten acclimated to our school yet? Sure have. That's... I see. Your ability to adapt to a new environment is impressive. By the way, if you ever need me for anything, most times you can find me in the lounge. However, I won't be present if there's business I must attend to. If I'm not at the dorm at night, then you'll have to put off any exploration for another day. I hope you understand. I wouldn't dream of going in without you anyway. Class is ended for today. Okay. Now I feel like since the old couple can be... We can visit them any day except Monday. So I feel like focusing on the school ones when they're available might be my main focus. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. Class finally let out, huh? You leaving for practice now? Wanna head to the track together? Okay, looks like we're going to actually increase the social link today. That's good. Um, let's see. Can I actually see on the map? Yes, you can see where everybody is that you can hang out with. And so the person out in the hallway is probably... Student Council? Oh, for next, Sam. Um, what do you want? Oh, we actually probably need to do work on this a little bit. I can't remember if what we answer for this is actually important. I just wanted to talk. I don't have anything to talk about. Oh, um, I'm I'm sorry. Oh, sorry about that. I I don't think she's willing to talk to me anymore. I should try again another time. Um, yeah, make sure you check it on, in on this girl whenever she's in the hallway. Oh, that, that one's my classroom. Okay. Um, let's just make sure. I'm not seeing anything else. I'm assuming if we went to the town map... Yep, we'd be seeing Iwatodai Station for the old couple. Let's go and hang out with Kaz and do one more rank of Chariot. What's up? Leaving for practice? Want to head to the track together? You bet. All right. That's what I like to hear. I uh, can't have you showing me up all the time. Time to put my game face on. All right. One more time. I'll show you what I'm made of. Huh? Uh, uh, damn it. Seriously? It's poor knee, man. Shit. Miyamoto! Cause! Anemia? Come on, we're counting on you to be captain next year. The big meet's next year, so you've got time. Just don't overdo it. Hey, you. Uh, why don't you leave practice early and take him home? Sorry. What are you looking at? I'm fine. Hey man, don't, don't, don't get it out on me. It's just, uh, my anemia is acting up. Sorry man, that sounds awful. Oh no, no, it's nothing serious. Damn it, I can't do it, I can't lie to you. Look, the truth is, it's my knee. 
It hasn't felt right ever since that day you first came to practice. I tried medicine, I tried wrapping it, but the pain won't stop. Will it heal? Of course it will. But I can't afford to stop training, so I'll play through the pain. Next year, there's a national competition. Athletes from all over Japan will be there. The regionals don't hold a candle in comparison. And if I want to win, then I have to spend the next year training. A lot of guys on the team are nosy as hell. If they find out about my knee, they won't leave me alone. So please keep it a secret, okay? We gotta look out for each other. Miyamoto seems to be counting on me. I feel like we're becoming closer. Chariot rank three. If I go easy on it, I can make it home by myself. Don't worry about me. You get on back to training. I parted ways with Miyamoto and went home after practice. Welcome back. Uh, by the way, the internet line which was ripped apart by the shadow earlier this month will be fixed tomorrow. If you have a computer in your room, you should be able to connect. So that takes care of everything that was damaged. No. Except, of course, Akihiko's ribcage. <laughs> Rough. Oh. Uh, speaking of the internet, uh, you play any online games, dude? Definitely. I don't actually in real life, I actually don't like online games anymore. I used to, you know, just like everybody else in their teen years, I played a lot of, like, COD and stuff online with friends, but, like, I don't like online games anymore. Maybe it's partially because, like, everybody that I would have played with no longer really plays online games either. Um, but yeah, like, just not my vibe anymore. I definitely prefer single player. But we're gonna say definitely. Yo. Nice, it just got, uh, I got just the thing then. Here, you gotta check this out. It's called Innocent Sin Online. I used to be totally addicted to it, but I got kind of burned out. Maybe you'll get a kick out of it. We got an online game that is definitely not a reference to another Persona game. He lies. Oh? Oh, Kusi's here. Tons of people all playing the same game together. And it's online, right? I imagine that makes it even harder to know who you're playing. I guess not knowing your enemies makes it easier in some respects. As for me, I prefer to look my opponent straight in the face before we compete. Hello. How are your explorations of Tartarus proceeding? You know, it could be better, so maybe not too hot? Yes. Well, don't trouble yourself over it, just aim to continuously hone your skills. Thanks, Akutsuki. Hmm? Hmm? Is something the matter? Hmm. Just wanted to chat. Online games? Well, some casual recreation is fine, but try not to get carried away. If it should devolve into an unhealthy obsession, need I say the rest? Oh, yeah! Oh, I'm so glad we can start using the internet again. I've been meaning to check out the new summer clothes that are coming out now. I guess I could look at magazines, but it's just quicker to check online. Plus, it's free. Oh, yeah! I hear lots of gamers love Innocent Sin online. Well, since tomorrow's holiday, you should play it, dude. And I shall. Okay, so we've got Chagall. We've got Arcade. Let's go and check them. Hey, there we go, House of the Deceased. We can get some more courage. I fearlessly stood my ground against an oncoming horde of zombies. Hey, rank two. Alright, when they inevitably come out with the reload vinyl, I'm buying it. I own every single other Persona vinyl. <laughs> Alright, not all of them, but I own many of them. Today is show -a day There's no school. Come to think of it, I should be able to connect to the internet now. I could try playing the game that Junpei gave me. 
Um, I might need to go into Tartarus somewhat soon, too. Start making progress, make sure I can get to the top. Alright, so this is definitely what we're going to do today during the day. Playing the online game. You can now use the computer in your room to play Innocent Sin online. Playing the game will take up time, but you might meet new people. Should I spend time at my desk until nighttime? Absolutely. Let's play an MMORPG. I think I'll spend the day playing games online. Autumn, the year 1990X. I have one new message. From Phil. <gasps> oh, okay. I made myself cough. Phil is in Philemon? Reality is just a series of events and players acting out what they believe to be true. When we accept that fact, our world becomes as real as any other. Reality is but a reflection of our own thoughts and expectations. But, what if we were merely reflections in someone else's mirror? Are you prepared to look through that mirror to discover the truth? I'm in Shinagawa Dungeon. I don't see any other players. A girl in red approaches me. Oh, this is really cool. You can actually, like, see the screen. I love it. Sup? ASL. I don't remember what that means. I don't have my leet speak down. Uh, oh wait, are you a noob? You are, huh? Oh wow, you haven't even finished making your chart character yet. Guess the new default skin thing was for real. I got this cool outfit and the patch too. Nah, like it brought in many new people. This is kind of a dead MMO these days. Uh, welcome to the game. Cool to see you around. It's not Bob. Who are you? <laughs> Sorry, I got kind of OOC there. We are supposed to be our alternative selves, right? Uh, yeah. So, what are you gonna call your character? All I see is no data. Um, hey, I got a good name for you. How about Tatsia? Yeah, that's perfect in my opinion. I'll change mine to Maya, okay? <laughs> Have a little deja vu? Heh, <laughs> that's clever. Oh really? I'm impressed. I didn't think many people played that. Well, if you see any jokers, be sure to rescue me, okay? Honestly, I've never beaten Persona 2. Uh, either of the... It, uh, either of them. I've played quite... Innocent Sin was the first of the two, correct? If that's the case, then I played through a big chunk of that game, but I don't think I ever finished it. I liked it alright. Like, obviously it's a little bit more dated as you'd expect, but the story's fantastic and the characters are fantastic. Anyway, I'm usually idling here on my days off. So if you're bored, maybe we can level together. It sucks to be lonely. Ouch, okay. I've become acquainted with a player who goes by the name Maya. Card number nine, the Hermit. So the Hermit suggests that you are in a phase of introspection while you are drawing your attention inwards and looking for answers within. You are in need of a period of inner reflection away from the current demands of your position. Sorry, gotta go. Remember, let's think positive. Tresto. Ha, <laughs> Tresto, that's funny. So Tresto gems allow you to escape a dungeon. <laughs> in uh, SMT games. Maya's player signed off. I decided to log out as well. Love that. I'm trying to remember if Tresto gems are in this game too. I can't remember. Yo. Yo, what's up? Oh yeah, you can use that computer over there whenever you want, by the way. You can put whatever software you want onto it too. Oh, but don't play online games on it. It'd suck if someone else accidentally used your account. Using the shared computer? Yeah, what is this? You can use the shared computer in the first floor lounge for research or to run purchased software. Okay. All software is single use only and can be purchased from Mongastar Net Cafe. Like many activities, using the computer will take up a portion of your day. 
Weird. Okay. Uh, maybe we'll go to the Net Cafe first to see what that's about? Seriously? Man, no one's back yet. And we have school tomorrow. I guess that means Tartarus is a no-go? Guess that's right. Nice. Alrighty then, time to hit the hay. None of those gems in here, right? It's a bank of consoles. Okay, nothing we can do with that yet. I heard that anyone can use this computer. Looks like there are some pre-installed programs. A package on the bookshelf has a sticker on it that says free to borrow. Should I borrow something? Digital cram school. Okay, just a big old academics dump for you maybe? Should I spend my time using the computer? PC software for freely learning about a variety of subjects. I might be undoing this because I actually want to go to the internet cafe and see what they have. It seems to be a set of practice questions from a famous school in the mountains. Whether you're brilliant or average, your journey here begins by answering questions all the same. I should try some questions in the areas I'm studying right now. I finish answering a challenging yet satisfying set of questions. I feel like I've gotten better at thinking outside the box. Okay, two points in academics, and it's basically free. At least that one is. Hey, it's gotten late. I should head back to my room. Okay, we're gonna reset and we're gonna go to the Net Cafe to see if there's something else we could do there. Don't worry, we're, we'll read that when we actually get there. All right. Honestly, I really do need to make sure that my academics gets up a little bit, um, because I think it does have an effect on your tests. Even if you answer all the questions right when you get to a test section, if you haven't met a certain threshold with your academics, I don't think you get max points, or you can't get a, a full scores. Game Parade Newsletter Come play our popular crane game and try to win a prize, then stick around and hop into one of our many immersive video games. There's great fun to be had, whether you're alone or with friends. We can't wait to see you. Part-time position open? We hope everyone is having a great day. Chagall is looking for someone to work at the cafe. Students may apply, no experience required. This is a paid position, and perks include free pheromone coffee. We look forward to meeting you. Okay, Net Cafe. Welcome. The software programs on our computers are available for sale at the counter. Manga Star Net Cafe is a vendor of PC software. You can run purchase software on the computer in the first floor dormitory lounge. Let me know when you've decided on what you want. And each of them can only be used once? Or no? Okay, Charm. Helping you attain a beautiful body, so that's probably charm as well then, right? I, it's interesting that some of them tell you, and some of them kind of obfuscate it. Learning English through pictures, okay, so that one's going to be, you know, learning. Courage. Courage. This one requires courage to defeat the zombies. So does it give you courage, or does it require courage and then you get, like, some other thing? I don't know. Strengthen your muscles. I wonder if that increases your strength. 
Mind, okay. So some of these are like stats as well. For those who love beef bowls, has a membership code for the official site? Okay, so if we want access to the beef bowl place, you can order in or something like that, right? So does that mean that we have to buy this and then we have to use it at the computer and then it does what exactly? We get, we can, or, we can just order in the beef bowls? All right, we're gonna have to find out how this works. Okay, so that was four, 450. God, I love this song. It makes me so happy. Straight to the lounge. Let's see what this does. The fan book came with a membership code that can be used on the official website. Let's take a look at Umiyushi's website. The Umiyushi official website. Members only, exclusive takeout perks. It looks like if I register, I'll be able to order takeout from Umiyushi. I should enter the membership code from the Umiyushi fan book. Thank you for registering. We hope you enjoyed the Umiyushi taste in the comfort of your own home. I mean, if this takes an extra step, you have to imagine that those beef bowls do something semi-decent, right? Looks like I've successfully become a registered member. We, You are now able to order takeout from Umiyushi at the Iwatodai Strip Mall. Okay. <laughs> we'll have to find out about that another night, so I guess we won't know if this is actually going to be useful or not, but... It's gotten late. I should head back to my room. I can hear people talking. Hey, listen! I spent my entire day off at the Net Cafe. You can play computer games there, so I ended up trying a bunch of different ones. Seriously? I knew that they sell computer software there, but I didn't realize you could use them in the private booths, too. It's always so packed there, though, so I never feel like going. Yeah, it was super crowded yesterday, too. It was a miracle I managed to get my own booth. Next time, I'll just buy the game. It's probably more relaxing to play it at home anyways. First bell is rung. I'm at Ogawa and I'll be teaching. Let's call it integrative learning. <laughs> My goal is to ease some of the stress you suffer as students, of which I assume there is plenty. Think of it as psychotherapy through magic. Yes, that's right. Quiet down. No talk in silence, I say. My god. These kids these days. Were you surprised to hear me bring magic up? Well, this study was very recently published, so it's not well known just yet. But those who believe will be saved, in other words, the placebo effect is hard at work. That means believe your studies are paying off, and eventually they will. <laughs> Alright then, let's get on with our first lecture, the basics of magic. Who can use magic and who cannot? That seems like a reasonable enough starting point. Some of you may think magic lets you do absolutely anything. Pulling pranks, raining vengeance on your enemies. Well, if those are the first wishes that run through your mind when it comes to magic, then I'll tell you now, you'll never master the craft. This is true of both Eastern and Western sorcery. Those with wicked hearts will be either powerless or driven to ruin. Clearly. Obviously. There's one more vital facet to learning magic, and that is the master. Practitioners should always aspire to become as knowledgeable as their predecessors, especially if they intend to study high-level magic. But without a master's careful instructions, learning the craft becomes wholly impossible. Once you've begun your training, you'll have to live in two worlds at once, the real world and the dark realm. If you ever lose the ability to distinguish between the two, then you'll be headed straight for disaster. That's what makes the guidance of a master absolutely vital. With all that out of the way, I'll move on to meditation, one of the standards in magical training. Who gave this guy a teaching license? Now, I've got some handouts here for you. I'm feeling sleepy. Should I close my eyes? Nope, we're gonna stay awake. Anytime we can get uh, academics from school, we're gonna do it. Well then, there are other ways to get courage. Well, looks like that's our time. If you think you might be interested in the practice, try meditating on the course of your day while lying in bed tonight. In vivid detail, recall each event taking place in reverse. Sort of like traveling back through time in your mind. 
If you ever reach the point where you can do it flawlessly, you just may have what it takes to become a good magician. <laughs> Alright, that's it for today. I force myself to stay awake and listen to the lecture. Class has ended for the day. Alright. I think for today, we are going to end this episode here. Now, let's see. Lovers, here, font, chariot, magician. Okay, so. Alright, well, we'll figure out what we're going to do in the next one. So, thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Have a good one, everybody. Bye.